Sometimes just a few moments can be the difference between life and death. Baby, come here. Come here. When our emergency animal medical technicians responded to a call for a baby goat who had gotten stuck in a storm drain, they knew their time to save him was limited. It wouldn't be until later that they realized just how limited that time was. I feel like if we had like, if we had like 10 more feet. We have a problem. There we are, we're out. When the snake cam they created was unable to spot the goat, they had no choice but to guesstimate where underground he might be. So they got to work. Through dirt, concrete, wires, and the pipe itself, the team spent hours chiseling at whatever they could in hopes it would give them their first look at where the goat was, as well as what condition he was in. Hey, just to give you an idea how far off we are and how close though, look at where that hole is and look yeah. where the pipe is. Things got their scariest when the baby stopped crying out for help. Why wasn't he crying? I know. He should be really loud right now. Some expected the worst, but all kept plugging away regardless. It was the idea to bring Mama nearby that may have helped turn the tide. <coughs> Guys! <coughs> He's right! I got you. Oh, there he is! Yeah, he just looked up. He just put his head right here. <coughs> Yeah, he's right there. Yeah. Okay, wait, wait. The, the clip is on this one. This yeah, one right here. Just gonna. We're right at the base. Here, actually, let me hammer here. it down. Here. Okay, hold on a second. See what this one is being hammered down. I'm not hitting him. No. Hey, Chi Chi. Here's your baby. Here, dude, there's one up. There's one on this side. Here, look, can you get, can you clip a little bit more of this Hi, one? Hi, baby! Okay, that one right here. Okay. I'm just gonna point it downwards. Hey, come on! Should we get water or anything? We're gonna get him out first. We almost okay, got Okay, if you're that close. Yeah, oh, yeah, we're that close. He's... Okay. Okay, Do we, if you need a little wider, wider, let us know we can chip around it. Let's try it. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Yeah, as long as we don't let go of that rope. He's fighting you with his hooves? Yeah, that's what I'm trying to get. Come on, come on. Come on, baby. Come on, you got both? Yeah. Yes, yes! Woo! You're free! After spending hours on the rescue, all it took was five minutes to remind the team why every second of their efforts counted. Because as soon as they began to pack up their equipment, the floodgates opened. Everything we did today is because of donors. Everything. We've got our, our equipment, our sledgehammers, our chisels, our snake cam. Everything we used to get that goat out was because of donors. Everything. We couldn't have gotten it out without the donations. We couldn't have. Our timing's perfect. He would have drowned down there if we left him. And we've spent six, I think, seven hours total out here trying to get him out. And we finally got him. Each year, Arizona Humane Society emergency animal medical technicians rescue more than 6,000 pets in need and continually demonstrate how they never give up when it comes to saving the valley's most vulnerable animals. Every shovel, every inch of rope, every second counts. If you'd like to help more pets in need, please visit azhumane.org donate.